staying with the Millers. In paradise. At uh, my family restaurant. Yeah, Randy owns this. <laughs> we wish. Uh, yeah, no, just kidding. But uh, we figured we'd try Miller's Ale House. Hey, babe, we've been here, I don't know, several oh, times, yeah. and yes, it's good. So we got good steaks. So guess what? Yep. We're on the hunt for a good steak. Gonna do a dining review. Continue yep. the battle of the steakhouses. All right. All right. We'll give you a little more information inside. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Got seated, and here's the menu. If I can get it far enough away from it. <laughs> kind of close quarters here. All right. This is like just a specialty menu. Yeah, this is the uh, guest favorite. All right. Salmon. Really yeah, it's a little. We call them pull and pop donuts. Hot the loaded fries. Now some milk head. Breakfast and fries. And we got a brunch burger. Got some shrimp fettuccine. And we got some wings there. On the main menu, here we go. Here's the zingers and wings. Cocktails and stuff. Appetizers. Here's some salads. Some pasta. And here we go. Here's the good stuff here. Grip, filet, ribeye, sirloin, prime rib. Yeah, a little bit of everything. They're trying to make your mind up here. Well, hey, you eat that thing, yeah. <laughs> you unlock your jaw. No, you already showed that. The prime that's burger, yeah. That's, 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 that's Honey Bun's favorite, though. Yeah, that sounds amazing. Captain Jack's buried treasure. We didn't get an appetizer, so maybe we'll have room for that. Maybe. <laughs> we generally order too much anyway. All right, we'll show you what we got. All right, what do you find? All right, so I looked up a little bit of information and there are 55 Miller's Ale Houses. Thank you, I brought a salad show Yeah. <laughs> show them in a minute. And, um, oh wait, let me back up. There's 55 in Florida. Then there's eight in Pennsylvania, seven in Illinois, six in New York, four in New Jersey, three in Tennessee and Maryland, two in Georgia and Ohio, and one in Delaware and Virginia. And the Miller's part of the name is a recent thing. They used to just be Ale House and the front of it would be whatever city it was in. So if it's in Ocala, Florida, it would be Ocala L House. But they recently changed that and they're all Miller's L Houses now. But that's a lot. I knew it was a Florida thing, but I had no idea there were that many. 50, Boy, not that, really. 55 just in Florida. But then there's several locations, other places too. So anyway, that's pretty cool. Yep. All right, so we're going to show our salads and dig in. Yep. We're hungry. We're hungry. Yeah. All right, here's my Caesar salad. Looks good, I know that. What honey bun you get? I just 
just got a garden salad or a house salad with ranch. It looks good. Yeah, it does. Sorry about the music. I don't know if it'd be copyright or not. Yeah, hopefully not. We might be doing some voiceovers or something like that. But, yeah, but we'll see. Anyway. All right, we're going to dig in. We'll show you the entrees when we get here. All right, wait for Jenny. Say what'll come to mind. <laughs> Hi, welcome to Miller's. Uh, thank you for coming in today. I hope you guys enjoyed your food. Oh, thank you. Yep. We'll, check, we'll check back in a few moments just to make sure everything looks yeah. good. You just brought a food. Yes. Thank you for show on YouTube. So. Yeah, and then if you have any room, I definitely recommend yeah. the ice cream yeah. Oreo cookie cake. Yeah, I've been it's eyeing that. It's a, it's a Captain Jack. It is a shareable dessert. Okay. Yep, All thank right, you. thank you. Yep, you're welcome. All right, here we go. Food is here. Six cents. Sirloin. Sirloin, yeah. yeah. Fried shrimp. They didn't offer grill shrimp, but they didn't fried shrimp. Sweet. And big potato. Lots of butter. Yeah, oh, yeah. Honey bun. And honey bun, is that, what do you call it? It's the Zingers. So Zingers are chicken fingers, but they're with sauce on it. And there was a ton of different sauces to choose from. So I got the Zinger mac and cheese, but my sauce that I got is honey barbecue. Because I don't I didn't want spicy. Yep. Looks so. good. Yep. Alright. First bite. Gotta get some mac and cheese. Yep. Get a perfect bite. And a piece of chicken. Cheers. Good. All right, let me get mine ready and Very good. I'll show my first bite. All right. All right. First bite of the steak. It's, uh, it's good. He said it was cooked perfect. Good to me. A little that, pink in the middle. Yeah, that was medium. Yep. Not ribeye, it's a little bit chewy. Still yeah. got some flavor. Yeah. All right, try to fix that. Plenty of butter. Plenty butter. Yeah, they brought lots and lots of butter. They were no stingy butter. with the butter. And he didn't even ask, they just brought it. Now you gotta try a right. shrimp. Try a shrimp. They didn't have real, they got fried. Cocktail sauce. Yeah, cocktail sauce. That's right. I might try one of those since it's right, fried. You, you don't like fried. Stay away. <laughs> eat your chicken finger. Okay, I'll eat Comment my... below if you ever seen a chicken with fingers. Yeah, have you ever seen a chicken with fingers? Why do they call them chicken fingers? Yeah, let us know. <laughs> All right, That's we're, we're, we're going to enjoy this. Well, you be the judge. Did I like it or not? <laughs> or does anyone like her? Yeah. <laughs> we shared a little bit. Said she doesn't like shrimp, but look at that. It's evident for them. <laughs> she don't know how she got there, or how they got there, she said. I don't. I don't know how I know, those I know got they got there. there. <laughs> Somebody said she might order a dessert. I think I'm going to have to get that. Yeah, that Captain Jack thing. Call her name. Yeah. We'll show you that here in a minute. All right. All right, what you got? 
All right, so the manager came over and talked to us, and we are in Claremont. That's the one that we came to. So you said it's on Highway 50? Yep, on 50. Okay, in Claremont. That's the one we're at. Like we said, they're all over Florida. But the manager came over to talk to us and asked us about our YouTube channel and make sure everything was good, which it was. And he gave us these little scratch-off cards. Um, they're good from April 9th to June 9th, and you scratch and win. So we're going to scratch it and see what we want. Yeah, might be a new car. He did say no new cars. <laughs> Darn. So, I guess I'm going to have to use my fingernail. <laughs> yeah, I don't have a coin in my pocket. All right, here we go. Maybe $100,000. Let's see. Exciting. Oh, yes. There we go. Ah, yes. This is free, the pull and pop donuts. Oh, yeah, it is. Now you can see it now. Yeah. Look at a little donut hole thing. Yeah, so that was my second choice on my dessert. I was torn between the donuts or that ice cream, but I went with the ice cream. But okay, we're coming back. Gonna get the donuts. Exactly. It's All on right. the next visit. On the next visit. Good on the next visit. Yeah. All right, let's see what. What else we got here? Uh -oh. All right. Free zinger, whatever that is. Those are the chicken fingers. Oh, okay. That I had. That okay. That's good. what I had. Yeah. She enjoyed them. Yeah. That's good. So this says. Uh, yeah, you get a free one order of zingers. There you go. Now you do have to purchase something in order to get these, but I mean, you're coming here, so of course you're gonna purchase something. Anyway, that's cool. Yep. Also, if you join their little club with that QR code and you sign up on their list, you get a free order of Zingers as well for signing up on your next visit. So, Cool. Lots of zingers coming and full and pop donuts. <laughs> I can't wait for the ice cream to get here. Yeah, I'll be here anytime now. Yep. We'll show that. All right, trouble has arrived. That's what it is, too, trouble. Oh, I don't believe I would call that trouble. Uh, it's a big trouble to me. Somebody's got a sweet tooth. It's me. I don't deny it. I might try a bite. You're gonna try a bite. Right. You like Heath Bar. It's got Heath Bar in it. Yeah, I do. All right, first bite. All right. Gotta get some whipped cream, some fudge. Rough, huh? <laughs> That's the best thing I've had today. It's, it's rough being a guinea pig, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's for science. Yeah, it's it is. For yeah. The channel. It's for you guys. Sacrifice yourself just for YouTube. Yeah. Sacrifice yourself. <laughs> to let you know if you should try this or not. Yeah. yeah. And you should. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure. Yeah. All right. Let's I, might, get, I might have probably. Yeah, let's get Randy a bite. My favorite part. All right. Yep. Go for it. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. 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 All right. That's good. No, you better try that. You got to get the fudge, though. Oh, yeah. Uh. And the caramel and the heat, the whipped cream, it's amazing. That is a 10 out of 10 dessert. Actually more like a 15 out of 10. Looks like fish. It does not. <laughs> That's good, but a little sweet for me. Yeah, not for me. Don't listen to him. He's not a dessert person. No. I am. Give me protein. 
That's good. Though. What would you give it though? What would I give it? Yeah. A flush? On a palm tree scale. Oh, full of chain. Flush. No, you would not. What would you give it on a palm tree scale? I'd give it an eight. No. That's too sweet for me. There's no such thing. It is. <laughs> All right, I'm going to dig in. Yeah, have fun. <laughs> I am. Order, order me a hamburger. All right, we're stuffed. I'm about to pop. <laughs> Literally. Yeah, whoa. That was a lot of food for the money. That was. We, we wanted to talk about the, Speaking of the money. The, the value and the price on things. So Randy got that six ounce sirloin and the fried shrimp. It was $16.99. With the baked potato. Yeah, with the baked potato. And... Um, Okay, so he added on the Caesar salad, which was two dollars to add on that Caesar salad, but it was only one dollar to add on twelve fried shrimp, because just the um, sirloin by itself was fifteen ninety nine. Um, who in the heck wouldn't add for one more dollar twelve fried shrimp? And they were good. Yeah, they were. They were really good. And then I had somebody, we had evidence of somebody eating a few of them. I might have tried them. Claims you don't like them. And then we had my Zinger's mac and cheese was fifteen ninety nine, and then I added on a house salad for uh, two forty nine, and then we already said that dessert was nine ninety nine. But this was excellent, and for the money, I'm really kind of blown away. With the combination, this is might be number one for us now, as far as the price and the food. Yeah, the. It was it's borderline the, right up there with Longhorn to me as far as the steak. That steak was so but good. But for the price, you can't beat it, I swear. Yeah, that, yeah. that steak was amazing. It really was. I yeah. ate two or three bites of it, and it was, oh, it was good. Yep, and the shrimp was good. My zingers and mac and cheese was great. I wish my only one thing, if I had to say something that they could do, is like a bread service. Like when you go to like I didn't need any but <laughs> Yeah, when you go to Longhorn or Texas Roadhouse or wherever, they bring you out the bread service first that's complimentary or included or whatever. So I kinda wish they might do a little bread service here, but if they had of, I wouldn't have been able to get that dessert, which I did and it was it was excellent. And then we'll definitely be back and we've got those um little scratch off things yeah. where we got the free zingers and the free donuts and so we'll definitely be back I think it's a good Miller's deal. Elf really? House yeah. <sighs> yeah so I'm I'm just gonna go ahead oh I'm gonna give it a 9.5 just because I was not crazy about my salad his Caesar salad was amazing if I had got the Caesar I would have probably given it a 10 out of 10 but I wasn't, the dressing, the ranch dressing on my salad was great. It's just that kind of lettuce. I wasn't crazy about it. But it's still, man, for the money, it, everything. It was clean. The service was great. Um, yeah, it was yeah. her name Jenny. 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 Yeah, thank you, Jenny. Yeah. Shout Appreciate out it. to that you. Was, that was great service. Yeah. yeah. But, uh, yeah, my, my salad, I mean, it was good. Don't get me wrong. It wasn't the best Caesar salad I've ever had. Well, when he first brought it, it was kind of dry, so I asked for extra dressing. So when once, he added once we that, got that, it was amazing, but it, it still wasn't the best I've ever had. But it, it was still dang all good. You mean the Caesar salad? The Caesar salad. Yeah, that's yeah. it. Anyway, but if, overall, what would you give it? Overall, about a three hundred. <laughs> now I give it. But the steak, the shrimp, which fried shrimp, they were great. Don't get me wrong. I, I prefer grilled shrimp, but. But if they had been grilled, then I wouldn't have eaten any, so. More for me, but. <laughs> no, I mean, they were great. Don't get me wrong. And that uh, cocktail sauce was perfect. It wasn't. It wasn't spicy. It wasn't too spicy or twangy or nothing like that. It was great, so. Not as good as uh, Bubba Gump's cocktail sauce, but. You mean tartar I mean, sauce? I mean, tartar sauce, but hey, it was still daggone good. Yeah. Baked potato was. Excellent. Great, yeah. Overall, I'd give it a 
I give it a ten. You know, nothing crazy. I just give it a ten. Yeah. Yeah, but we're full. <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah. And and we came at was it four? It was about three thirty when we got here on a Saturday. Oh, it was, and we walked right in. Which we did that intentionally. Yeah, we came. So it's so crowded, but. Yeah. We may end up doing some voiceovers because there was a lot of music playing. So I'm not sure if some of that's copyrighted or not, but we'll see. We'll see. But so if you hear a lot of music in the video, and that's fine. But if you see a lot of fine. talking and just not much music, then we had to do a voiceover. But and I might have to match up to the words. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But anyway, we'll see what happens. That's the bad yes. thing about some of the restaurants; they have a lot of music playing. So whatever. Yeah. All right. I'm highly, highly recommend it yeah, yeah so if, yeah we gave you the location so if you are around one definitely check it out so yeah, so good like she said a lot of them in florida but it, you've got a, several other seats too yeah which i didn't know so this is this is what the third one i've been to i think this is by far the nicest of course it's the newest too yeah this one is the nicest one that we've yeah, been it's in just, they just opened it up six months ago i guess yeah, I mean, it's so clean. But, it's, yeah, it's nice. Modern looking, clean, yeah. Yep. All right, well, I guess we better wrap this up. We got a few more errands to do. But yeah. thank you so much for uh, joining us as we had our dining review at Miller's Ale House. Definitely highly recommend it. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you've ever eaten at a Miller's Ale House, let us know and let us know what you got and if you liked it, what your experience was. Please subscribe to the channel and uh, click that notification bell so you're notified every time we uh, upload a new video. And give us some ideas about some new chain steakhouse type restaurants. Yep. We haven't got into the high dollar ones yet. But That's coming. Still working on the, the budget friendly ones. but anyway. Yeah. But I uh, can't imagine they could be better than this, but yeah, we'll it's see. It's hard to be here, I tell you, for the money. Yeah. But thank you again uh, for watching and wrap this up. Remember, Paradise State of Mind. Yes, it is. Especially when you got a steak. <laughs> we'll see you on the next All one. All right. Bye.